YouTube, so, uh, what? What is it? What? 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 Oh, this thing, this thing, yeah, um. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I found this in my library, it was the book of the week, so I thought, hell yeah. So I'm going to read that, and I'll get back to you about it next vlog. Moving on. As you know, it, all, it is Creativity Week, so I'm going to talk to you about being creative. And my way of creativity is writing, of course. So, uh, I'm gonna I'm going to tell you a brief little guide about writing. So, I'm going to tell you how to write books. And I think writing is actually be, be sort of the theme of the creativity theme. Because Bridget wrote a poem, which is very good. Name wrote a short story, which was absolutely amazing. And now I'm telling you how to write stuff, so, yeah! I think all writing comes in three stages. Stage one. Stage one is the inspiration stage. It's the part where you actually think, yes, I have an idea, I shall go write about it. I'm going to use my own book as an example, Slinker. I've got the inspiration for Slinker in a character chat. And if you don't know, that's where you create a character and then chat as that character. The way it started was, I created a character. I created a backstory for the character. I created sort of a history for this character. As a sort of how he got to be who he was, and from there, I developed the story of the character. And that's what I wrote. Stage two. Okay, so stage two, you can call it like conceptualization or visualization. I call it depiction. And what depiction is, is just actually thinking of what happens in the book rather than thinking of it as a character. Changing it from inspiration into a general theme to an actual plot line with people and texts and awesomeness. Uh, the way I do this personally is by imagining my book, my thing, to be a movie. I imagine it as a big blockbuster movie. I'm sitting in front row, you know, just with the popcorn and with the popcorn and you know, and I'm and I'm just sitting there thinking, right, I've had the storyline. How am I going to turn it into a book? And I sit there and I go through it step by step, and I turn. Each scene into a chapter, each piece of dialogue into text. And these things are horrible to read, by the way. Yeah, yeah. I'm just going to cut that bit out. And I change it into text. I change it into text in my head, and I write down the text, sort of in shorthand. Stage three. So, stage three is the longest stage by far. It's the. I, you can call it motivation, or you can call it perspiration. And that's actually sitting down and taking the time to write and edit the book. But there's no real way around this, you just sit down and write it. You can talk about it with friends. I had a very, very good friend, called him Charlie. Hi, Charlie! And she helped me be motivated throughout the entire writing of this book. I actually put her in the book. Look, as one of the main characters. Again, go read it. So, um... Yeah. So that's just, that's just how I choose to write books. I mean... In, it's, yeah. And also, on the subject of writing... Name, I saw your video yesterday, it was good, but you forgot to mention one thing. How dare you forget to mention that one thing! I'm, I'm kidding, he let me mention it because I wanted to. Um, Name and me are going to be writing a sort of a fantasy sort of dual action theme, theme story. It'll be called Two Travels, it'll be on Tumblr as soon as I've actually gotten around to writing my bit of it, because I haven't yet. I'm sorry, Name, please don't kill me! Uh, another thing, uh, last Sunday, me and Rihanna hit Birmingham, and you can see that video up here, just click my hand. No, seriously, click my hand. Click on my hand. Look, look, it's doing Vulcan for you. It's, it's Vulcan. It's Vulcan. You must click on my hand. Okay, so, uh, I've now got to edit all of that down into four minutes. So, uh, yep, DFDBA, I'll see the rest of the Hepton next week. And, uh, Rihanna, I'll see you on Sunday again.